guys, this is Zach and I'm cooking some oh, I forgot what those were. I was cooking hot chicken wing buffalo dip. Um, okay. We wanna need we need some chicken, some hot sauce, some cheese, some cream cheese, and it really doesn't matter. I just always use, like to use most of the time great value. And what I like to do, I like to add, what do you want to do first? We we'll put the cream cheese in. Hold on. Okay. And you're going to want to smooth it out almost kind of equally on the bottom. What you're going to want to do, make sure it's almost equally all on the bottom of it so it should kind of look like you made another four. much but that's okay because you're gonna want something to equal out the hot sauce so it's not too hot you're not gonna want something that's gonna make it too like creamy like because we're using cream cheese so okay so once you got that done what I'm saying right here should look like that like a paste smeared out on the bottom Okay, once you've done that, you're going to want to take your chicken, you're going to want to open it, and I don't have an open. To let that sit for a little while, and if you want, this is optional. You can add, you can add the ranch powder, like to make ranch. But you're gonna want to put that like on the same as you did for the cream cheese. Okay. Because a lot of times, I make, sometimes when I make, not a lot, but sometimes, when I make it, some of the liquid of the chicken comes up and it makes it really, really bad. Cat, what do you want? Okay. So that should be, that should be good. And you're going to want to cut it up. And then, Distribute the chicken out equally. Okay. 
because you're going to want some of the, you're going to want it covering, you want the chicken covering most of the area of the cream cheese over it to make sure that you don't have any blind spots. So you got an equal taste in most of the spots. Personally, I'm just taking this from my mom's recipe. She usually makes this, so I'm guessing when I'm making this, I'm making this. It's gonna, it's gonna be. I don't know. I like this a little bit because when you got the hot sauce and you mix it with the cream cheese and the chicken, it just makes a really, really, really creamy, hot, sour kind of good taste. Okay, once you're done putting the chicken over it, you're gonna want to put hot sauce. This is where. The hot sauce comes in. You're gonna want it spread it equally, and you're gonna want a lot, a lot of it. Okay, a bit here, a bit here, then a little bit here. That should be good. Okay, then let's get that done. Next, shoot. Okay, once you're done with that, we'll put that up. We'll take the cheese out. You want a lot of cheese, trust me. Okay, you're gonna sprinkle that like a pizza, basically. Maybe like four or five handfuls of cheese. Because you're gonna want it covering because it's gonna look good once you're done with it. Sometimes a little bit extra cheese, but then that ends up when it turns out. Not to be such a good idea, because you don't want a lot of stuff in one dish. Because that would just be awful. Okay, around the edges. That way, covering up red, most of it. Okay. There you go. And finish it off. Add a little bit more hot sauce, because everyone loves hot sauce. This area, you don't have to put the last thing of hot sauce on top of it, but I like it a little bit spicy, a little bit tangy, when you zipper zangy. You add that, okay? And then you're gonna, what you're gonna wanna do, that's how it's gonna end up looking. Not gonna, oh, oh no. Oh no! Uh, a little bit cheesy. Get rid of the evidence. There you go. Okay. You saw how this gonna look. You're gonna wanna open up the microwave. And you're gonna want to zap this for at least seven, I mean not seven, two minutes and thirty seconds. Okay. Put our stuff off, and then we'll see how it unfolds. So in the background, that's just, uh, I'm just watching a movie.
Okay, now it might not look good as a boot. Alright, make it. Is it like lunch or dinner? And one and two. Some stuff. Well, this is the buffalo chicken ranch cream cheese dip. Thanks for watching and tune in next time.